Today we're going to look at how you can calculate the volume of an enclosed shape with solid edge. I've created this pipe using the express route feature within solid edge. Now that the pipe's created, I need to know how much volume I have within the pipe. Here's an easy way to do that. I'm going to start by creating a new part. I'm going to transition to ordered. And then I'm just going to do a part copy. I want to find the part that I'm working on, which is that pipe, and bring it in. Now the key is we want to copy this as a construction body. So make sure you get that set because we don't want the solid to come through. Simply click OK and finish. So there we can see that part copy of our pipe. We're going to go to the surfacing tools. We're going to use copy. I'm going to change to a chain just so I can make one button click. Click that inside surface of the pipe. You can see it selects all of them within the chain. The next tool I want to use is Bounded. So Bounded will take and plug the inside of this pipe. So I'll do it on the left. And on the other side. I'm then going to just hide my hard copy. The next thing I want to do is just stitch these together using the stitched command. So the stitch command can take multiple surfaces, which is what we have, and stitch them together. A pop-up uh, shows me this is going to turn this into a solid, and that's exactly what we want. So we'll just say yes. So now we've got this solid feature and what it represents is the volume within our pipe. So now all we have to do is go to inspect, go to the properties. We'll need to define um, what property is in there. For our purposes, we're going to use water. Apply that to the model. It's kind of cool. It turns it blue. Just hit a quick update and look at that. I've got the mass, the volume, and the surface area. 